What's up? This is Fairfilm. Today we're going to show you a quick test of the time code accuracy of the ambient nano locket. This little experiment was designed based on Hal Ranley's article of a similar test on his gear using Zoom F4 and Tentacle Sync. Link in the description below. So the gear we're using are a pair of ambient nano locket time code generator and a Zoom F8 to jam and record the time code so we can compare them on the computer. Note that all of the equipment are my personal gears that purchased using my own money. Now let's get started. So we turn on the two units and reset the time code on the mixer to zero. There's one more settings to change for this test. Since now the locket has the thing called ACN, which means once the time code on one of the generators is jammed, they will keep syncing with each other all the time. So in order to test the accuracy, we need to turn it off. Now we should be ready to jam. Jam the time code on the first unit. And jam the time code on the second unit. Look the LEDs on two units are blinking at the same speed. We should be ready to go for another 14 hours. Now they have running for about 14 hours. Let's record the time code onto the mixer. We're going to record one of the time code directly to the time code in on the mixer. Change the settings on the mixer to receive external time code. Plug it in and now we see the mixer switches to the external time code. At the moment I was unable to find my TRS to XLR adapter, so I have to use the microphone unit from my H5 which also compatible with F8 and it provides a TRS input jack to allow us to record another timecode track onto an audio file. But there's a problem. I'm not sure how this module connects with the F8. Will it introduce delay between the timecode and the sound signal? If I find in my adapter, I might redo this test later. Subscribe to see future test videos. Now we have our file recorded and loaded onto the computer. Let's put it into Tentacle Sync Studio. We can see the file timecode and audio timecode are the same. Let's open the info panel. And notice the offset under the timecode section. It's 525 samples, about 10 milliseconds. Even we might have the delay introduced by the module, but we are still way under one frame. Also, I turn off the ACN. In real world, if we turn on the ACN, these timecode boxes will never out of sync. Alright, thanks for watching today's video. We still have three more tests coming. Subscribe to see future videos.